Hi and welcome to day 10 of the Intuitive Advent with me, Ruth Ann Richards. And I'm starting with a question for you. Have you ever wondered why we use the word vibes to explain a connection with someone or how we feel about something? It's not our vibe or I vibe with this person. And, you know, you vibe with a tribe. You've probably heard that phase. Well, I wanted to offer you an explanation of that today because it's a term I use a lot, vibrational frequency. And I think it does have a strong spiritual connotation as well. So where do we start with vibration? We start with our physical body. And there is scientific evidence and research that shows from our heart center, there is an electromagnetic wave, an electromagnetic field wavelength that actually comes from this space. And that shouldn't surprise us because our body is made of so much stuff and, and we create energy from our body that we would have that kind of, you know, energetic wavelength coming out of it. So it extends about five metres from our heart centre. So that's our vibration. That's what we have. So if we are in a low mood, it's a low vibrational wavelength that's coming out. If we're feeling more optimistic and upbeat, it's a higher vibrational wavelength that comes out. So if each and every one of us has that when you meet someone for the first time or you're meeting someone that you haven't seen for a while they too have the same thing so here you have all these wavelengths connecting around the place and what happens when those wavelengths connect they create energy they create another energy so you will see instantly from your wavelength when it connects with someone else's whether or not you have a vibrational frequency that matches or whether there's something you can tell about that person from their vibrational frequency. So if I saw a friend I hadn't seen for some time and we normally really happy and upbeat when we meet and she wasn't like that, I would say she had a low vibe and so there was something wrong and I need to ask her how she is. And then sometimes you meet people and you get all excited because both of your vibrational frequencies are very high. But then sometimes you meet people and you just, you want to walk away, you don't feel comfortable for them, you don't think they resonate with you. And resonate is another good word, scientific word that spiritual people use as well. Resonance another good word to say whether or not something, you know, matches your wavelength. So that's one of the reasons I want to offer you why we use the word vibe, why the vibration is so important in spiritual terms to work out who we resonate with and how people are. So remember, the vibration makes a connection. And from that connection, we decide who we vibe with and who we don't. I would love to hear what you think about that explanation. If you've got a different one to offer, do leave a comment in the notes for me. See you next time. Bye.